Hey everybody, this is Ebony Shanae here with Soundwaves Radio, standing here today at the movie premiere Touched with Art. How are you, Art? Well, thank you. How are you? Thanks for having me. Good. I'm great. I'm so excited for this movie. I know that it has a positive message and encouragement within people. Can you tell me a little bit about your character? Uh, I play a part that I'm accustomed to, an SVU detective, okay, which I've worked for with the Philadelphia Police Department for 14 years before retiring this past January 8th. So I've been in law enforcement for 36 years. So, uh, But my part is with Stephen Baldwin, who plays Nick, and we're doing a surveillance. And that's about much I can say right now. That's all you can tell me. Oh, give me a little bit more. So wait, so this part I don't be a is... Spoiler. I don't want to be a spoiler. <laughs> this part is basically just you being yourself because you've done this before, correct? Correct. Right, right. So were there any challenges at all? Like, once you got this part, preparing for this role? Uh, not, not really. And it gave me the lines. I memorized the lines and... Uh, it was easy from that point on. I just ad-libbed some of the lines, but uh, it was pretty easy. Nice, nice. So is, is this your first film? Actually, it's my second. I played in another one called Universal Signs. I didn't have a speaking role because it was for the deaf. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. I'll put two and two together with that. So is there anything else coming up that you're working on? Uh, not at the moment. Since I retired, of course, Terrence thinks that I'm going to be getting a lot of calls after everyone sees this film. But we'll see. If it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it's up to the Lord. You might you might get up there and move to Hollywood one day. Forget about us little people. Never. I can never forget about the little people, especially all the children that we investigated over the years. I mean, they're firsthand. They're, they're the ones I think about. We get over 20. Well, I don't I don't get them anymore, but we would get over 2,400, 2,500 cases a year in Philadelphia alone of child sexual abuse. Wow, wow. So you say you worked in S SVU. Do you watch Law & Order SVU? Because that's like one of my favorite shows. I did a couple times, but it's really not a real-to-life situation. So, I mean, it's, it's, you know, they make it big so people can watch it, So which is nice. I mean, it, some of it's true, some of it's not. So can you tell me one thing that you think someone will take from this uh, movie once they film it today, or once they view it today? Uh, they'll see how serious that this heinous crime is and what effects it has on children and adults. Um, it, it's a powerful movie. I've only seen about 50 minutes of it. Uh, and Terrence did a great job with it. The director, the producer, the, the camera crew, they did an awesome job with it. And I think people will really open their eye. It'll open everyone's eyes as to they need to start, people just need to start talking about this big time. I, it makes me tongue-tied and stutter uh, because I know firsthand what happens. I mean, it didn't happen to me, but it was almost like it happened to me doing the investigations. I could see the tears that come out of these children's eyes and how it affects them. And you're going to see that in this film as well. well. I'm excited to see this movie. I've been thinking about it all day. And I'm thank you so much for stopping by with us, telling us about your character. Thank you. Thanks. And this is Ivani Shanae, and we out.